What if the smartphone world as we know it was about to be turned on its head? Huawei has just unveiled Harmony OS Next, marking its boldest move yet to break free from Android's grip and challenge the dominance of iOS. Is this the birth of a true contender to the mobile OS throne? Stick around because we're diving deep into the story behind this daring leap and what it means for the future of smartphones. Huawei has always been a pioneer in innovation, but this time, it's rewriting the rulebook. For years, the tech giant relied on the Android Open Source Project, AOSP, to power its devices. However, the launch of Harmony OS Next signals a dramatic shift, a complete break from Android and a new proprietary operating system built from the ground up. This transformation isn't just about moving away from Android, it's about creating a cohesive, future-proof ecosystem that can rival giants like Google and Apple. With its debut alongside flagship devices like the Mate 70 series, Mate X6 Foldable, and the MatePad Pro tablet, Harmony OS Next is already making waves. But this ambitious move raises questions. Can Huawei truly compete on the global stage? And how does Harmony OS Next stack up against Android and iOS? Let's dig in. In an announcement that sent shockwaves through the tech world, Huawei's CEO Richard Yu revealed that by 2025, every Huawei device, smartphones, tablets, wearables, and more, will run on Harmony OS Next. This vision represents more than just a software upgrade. It's Huawei's commitment to becoming independent of US tech restrictions and building its own identity in the mobile space. For now, this transition is primarily targeting Huawei's domestic market in China, where the company already holds a strong foothold. Harmony OS Next is set to dominate its ecosystem, with offering seamless integration across devices like smartphones, tablets, and smartwatches. But what about the global market? That's where things get tricky. While Harmony OS Next is gaining traction in China, its expansion into international markets faces significant hurdles. The biggest challenge? building a robust app ecosystem. Analysts like Rich Bishop, CEO of App in China, highlight a major roadblock. Global developers are hesitant to build apps for Harmony OS due to limited revenue potential in China. Without big-name apps like Instagram, Spotify, or WhatsApp, convincing global users to switch to Harmony OS becomes an uphill battle. There's also the issue of functionality. Imagine owning a Harmony OS-powered smartphone, but the apps you rely on daily don't work or are unavailable when traveling outside China. It's a tough sell for consumers who prioritize convenience and compatibility. How Harmony OS stands out. Despite these challenges, Harmony OS Next is packed with features designed to set it apart. Let's break down what makes this operating system unique. Unified Ecosystem. Harmony OS Next allows seamless integration between Huawei devices, offering a smoother, more connected user experience. Imagine controlling your smart home, tablet, and smartwatch effortlessly from your smartphone. Optimized performance. Built with Huawei's latest Kirin processors and powered by advanced AI, Harmony OS Next promises faster multitasking, lower latency, and improved efficiency compared to Android. Enhanced security. Privacy and security are at the forefront, with Huawei claiming end-to-end -end data encryption and AI-driven threat detection. Customizable interface. Harmony OS Next offers a highly personalized user experience, catering to individual preferences and needs. Let's talk about market share. In China, Harmony OS Next has already made an impact, capturing 17% of the smartphone market and surpassing iOS at 16%. Globally, however, it's a different story. Harmony OS accounts for just 4% of the worldwide market, with Android dominating at over 80% and iOS holding a strong position. Breaking into the global market will require more than innovation, it'll require apps, partnerships, and overcoming geopolitical hurdles. Huawei's journey with Harmony OS Next is far from over. The company is playing the long game, betting on steady growth rather than quick wins. But will that be enough to challenge the Android iOS duopoly? The stakes are high. If Huawei succeeds, it could pave the way for other companies to follow suit, breaking free from the stranglehold of existing operating systems. If it fails, it risks being relegated to a niche player, influential only within China. So, what does the future hold for Huawei and Harmony OS Next? Will it become a global contender, or will it remain confined to its home turf? Only time will tell. But one thing is clear, Huawei isn't backing down, and the tech world is watching closely. What do you think? 
Does Huawei have what it takes to challenge Android and iOS on a global scale? Or is this mission impossible? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to stay updated on all things tech. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.